investors have their gaze fixed on today's 13.5 billion naira auction, Tibil's auction, which is fueling the cow market on the tone as market players await the result of today's offering. Meanwhile, interbank rates are poised to expand given the 264 billion naira bond auction settlement. Today, Chukawa Chuku, head of fixed income trading at UBA, joins me now for more market updates. Thank you so much for joining us on the show today, Chuka. Thank you, David. Now, let's talk about the highlights we've seen from the market from Monday's bond auction and then up until now where we are seeing uh, this smaller volume of 13.5 billion Naira T-bills auction come to play and investors just waiting to see what comes. Okay, thank you. Um, it's been an interesting week. Um, like you rightly mentioned, uh, we started the week uh, with the bond auction where we had uh, 225 billion on offer across three maturities of uh, 2029, um, 2032, and then um, 2032, and then uh, 2037. Um, we saw um, a drop in yield, significant drop in yield, you know, across the board, um, from uh, 15 percent to I mean 15 basis point to about uh, 45 basis point. Uh, we saw um, the longer end. Uh, drop about 40 basis points, uh, which is th that is the 2037. It dropped from 16.2 uh, percent um, the last uh, previous auction to 15.8, uh, and that's about 40 basis points, quite huge. Uh, this bond currently is trading around um, uh, 14 levels. Uh, um, this is because um, a lot of people went short on this bond, and then they are looking to cover those who lost at the auction. Um, on the T bills auction, like you rightly mentioned, today um, we have uh, just a small amount of um, um, a maturity which is on offer at uh, 13.5 billion. Um, the last uh, auction results, uh, the longer end came out around uh, 13.09. Um, we expect to see this come out around these levels. Um, there isn't much uh, to expect from this bond. I mean, from this uh, T bills auction actually. Yeah. And Chuka, the market is also expecting a whole lot of information overflow tomorrow. We're expecting the new Naira notes to begin circulation and also the inflation figures for the month of November. The forecast that we are going to see another spike as well. How do you think this is also going to tilt the balance in the financial market? Yeah, um, the, the, okay, let me start with the, Naira note, the new Naira note. I mean, it's already been priced in. Uh, yeah. I don't think there will be any significant change. Uh, bearing in mind that um, it, this policy won't take effect until the 9th of January. So we wait to see what the market reaction will be on the 9th of January. But for now, there isn't much reaction on that. Um, on the inflation figure, yeah, it's, uh, it's legally anticipated. Um, the last uh, figure, uh, inflation figure came out um, at 21.09%. Uh, uh, we expect to see this uh, slightly moderated upward. Um, I, I don't think it will be um, it will it will come out lower. I feel it probably will come out uh, slightly higher, but not as much as um, um, as high as as um, 21, 30 percent. Uh, so um, I, I I think that the market also has also been expecting that um, the inflation figure will continue to go up, and also has also been, been have been pricing as well. 